Hello everyone, this is Sai Krishna in love with marketing. Today let's look at an example of account based marketing. It is a use case uh, where an organization have uh, a very good decent amount of revenue coming from very few strategic accounts. Let's say 20% or 30% at least that they're getting from few accounts. In that case, you can use ABM as a solution. And the kind of strategy that you can use is ABM blended where you use both the ABM strategic and ABM light types as well. Strategic as in one to one approach and uh, light as in one to few approach. Uh, here the personalization would be to the best to the maximum and when it comes to one to few you will have a, a personalization of at least 30 percent uh, the kind and uh, the number of net new accounts and existing accounts that you are going to select depends upon your current existing accounts if you see a lot of current existing accounts are uh, you know very well potential enough to be tapped then you will have more percentage of existing accounts than uh, net new accounts but usually abm strategic will have more of existing accounts than net new accounts when it comes to abm light they will have more of uh, net new accounts than existing accounts in a blended approach having a look at your existing accounts and your criteria of identifying accounts you will understand what kind of uh, mix have to happen between net new accounts and existing accounts once you decide on this mix uh, you will you will come up with a criteria for uh, account identification and with this criteria you will identify your accounts and then you will do research on your accounts and then you will do a prospecting where you will be profiling all the key stakeholders involved in those accounts and you will be developing personalization of uh, value proposition of offering uh, content assets you know messaging uh, solutioning everything that is possible and personalization depends upon if that account is coming from you know ABM strategic uh, type or if that account is coming from ABM light uh, you know when it comes to ABM strategic uh, you will have a hundred percent personalization that was what we were talking isn't it um, and uh, after this after developing personalized uh, you know uh, messages or value propositions content then you will go to developing an account action plan if it is a strategic you each and every account will have a separate account action plan if it is a uh, you know abm light one to few then they are clubbed into micro clusters and each uh, micro clusters will be having an uh, action plan we'll have to develop these action plans with a uh, integrated campaign plan as well once you have this plan in place, you will execute the integrated plans and usually the kind of mediums that we would be selecting is email campaign, uh, executive events, industry events, uh, direct mailer, uh, account based advertising or, uh, you know, sharing, you know, personalized co uh, content, you know, that is valuable to them in the form of white paper, you know, or case study or uh, videos or infographics or anything. Uh, and also even calling and meeting in, in meeting them in person this all a part of you know omni channel approach and then once you execute your integrated campaign you will have to evaluate the results uh, see the metrics here could be uh, dependent on the channels that you are using and also uh, reports will come in two levels one if it is strategic account each and every account will have a separate report account performance report if it is a you know one to few kind of account then each and every micro cluster will have a, a performance report this this is one level of reporting and the second level of re reporting is that you know the entire performance of the abm program itself where you will talk about the number of net new accounts uh, that have been taken into consideration or the net new accounts that have been closed or the number of meetings that have been uh, placed uh, you know meetings with the c level or vp level uh, the percentage of target accounts that got engaged over a period of time and the pipe value that it has generated and also net new ACV that has been closed. And there can be a lot of other metrics on at ABM program level and metrics on account level depends upon the channels and, and the kind of uh, data that is ca being captured at account level. This is one of the most common use cases of account based marketing where you will be able to tap the best out of your target accounts.